Hi Toggle, Faiza shifted to Chennai and I'm missing him. Well, you can call him or write an email to him. Yeah, before leaving, Faiza said we could email each other and gave me his email ID. But I don't know how to create one for myself. Can you help me with it, Toggle? Sure, Goggle. You know what an email is, don't you? Sure. An email is an electronic message sent from one computer to another. I can include text, pictures and also sound in it. Very good, Goggle. An email is lightning fast. Can have a few lines or a thousand lines of text. Can be received at any time. And best of all, it's free! <laughs> yes, practically so. Okay now, I'll show you how to use the email facility. I'll send a card to my friend using my ID. A valid email account is a combination of the domain name and the username. You can see here that my email account is smart toggle at the rate of gmail.com. Gmail is the domain name and my username is Smart Toggle. So, what do we do with it now? I will show you. I'll open the home page of Gmail where I'll enter my ID and password. There we are. I have been given access to my account and this is where I can check and send emails to my friends. Now look at this screen carefully. All the folders are on the left side of the screen. The inbox stores the incoming email messages. Unread messages are highlighted. What is the draft folder for? The draft folder stores messages that you started to write and you have not yet sent. While the sent folder stores sent messages. Trash stores messages you have deleted. It will be stored only for a few days, usually seven days, after which the folder is automatically deleted. Why does it store the deleted messages? <laughs> only so that you will have a chance to retrieve any message you may have deleted by mistake. Oh yes, that's a useful feature. Now contacts stores email addresses of your friends and other email contacts. You can send files as attachments with your email message. To create a new message, click Compose. Enter your friend's address. Type out a subject in the subject box, say Happy Birthday. Now, to send a card as an attachment, Follow these steps to attach files. Click attachment on the compose message screen. Locate and select the file that you want to attach and then click open. I will attach this greeting card. Once you get the attached file information, click send. It will reach my friend's inbox in a few seconds usually. A copy of the sent message is stored in the sent folder. Click your account name or your photo. If you have uploaded a photo, then the photo will appear in place of account name on the top right corner of the window and select the sign out option to close your session. Toggle, that's so cool. Tell me how to open my own email account please. In a jiffy goggle, first of all, Connect to the internet and open any web browser. Say Internet Explorer. Type www.google.pk In the address bar and click enter. The Google home page will appear. Click Gmail. Gmail landing page appears. Click Create an account to create your new Gmail account. Fill up this registration form and you will soon have your ID and password. I'll just fly around for a while and come back. Cheers!
Hooray! I do have an email ID now. Well done, Google.